Hey guys, welcome back to Tech Club by Chandrasekhar, and, and today I'm going to show you how to get the Android Oreo on your Galaxy S6 Edge and the Galaxy S6. And before I showed you a couple of fixes for the ROM and the first look and a basic overview to install the ROM, but today I have something different, and it may fix a lot of your problems with this ROM. So we're just gonna do that today. So. Let's get into it. So first of all, what you're gonna do is you're gonna download the files that are present down in the description. It is really important that you download them. There are four files. One is the ROM file, then the kernel, then you have the Magisk, and then you have the Google applications. So first of all, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go and turn off your device, and now you're gonna go into the custom recovery. And to do that, you're just gonna press volume up key, home key, and power key at the same time. And now you're gonna let go of the power key, and it is booting into the custom recovery now. And you're gonna select wipe over here, and you're gonna tap on advanced wipe, and you're gonna select the Dell Vega RT cache system data and cache, and you're gonna swipe to wipe. Then you're gonna go back, back, and back, and you're gonna go in install. And first of all, you're gonna select your lineage OS file over here. So this is the latest build. It is the 5th September build, so we're just gonna select that and swipe to confirm flash. And the ROM takes not a lot of time to install. It gets installed fairly quickly, so that is a great thing. And now you're gonna go back and you're gonna tap on this install image over here. And you're gonna select this kernel lineage OS 15.0, and you're gonna select the boot over here, and you're gonna swipe to confirm flash. And now you're gonna go back and back, and now you're gonna click on install zip, and you're gonna tap on Magisk version 14.0, and you're gonna swipe to confirm flash. And now you're gonna go back, and I have two link for the Google applications, so you can have the Pico version or the Micro version. So the Pico version comes with the Play Store and all only and the micro version has a little bit of more applications. So I'm gonna go with the Pico because I don't really need much of the Google applications and I'm gonna download them from the Play Store. And it is also the latest one. So it is the 6th September build. So I'm just gonna install that and we're gonna tap on that and swipe to confirm flash. So now you're gonna reboot the system, and the lineage OS is booting now. So the device is booted up, and you have, I think, uh, the setup over here, which was not present in the last one, and it is now detecting my SIM card. So I'm getting the LTE signal over here. Let's just skip that. So I'm just gonna go with start as new. I'm gonna skip connecting my Wi-Fi. So the device just booted up, guys, and now the back key and the option key also work. So that is really great. And you have all of the things. It is the Android Oreo. So we are gonna go in the system and it may feel a little bit slow in the beginning but it takes a little bit of time to get it working smoothly so in a couple of minutes it will start to work smooth and as you can see we have the android oreo over here which is really great you have the octopus game or something over here which is lagging a little bit you have the phone application which works perfectly i think now and you have everything over here you have the new oreo style notification bar you have the application drawer but you have i think old icons for the applications and some of the applications are old as well they are not new over here and now you have the play store as well so that is really great and all of your problems will be solved by that so that is not a problem so let's check out the camera application and it does not come with one this time and you have to download it from the play store so i recommend the open camera which i've heard works really wonders with this rom so 
this is just great and you have a fully functional android oreo on your galaxy s6 edge so i really love that and let's go and see the android oreo logo once again so i think that's it if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and if you're new here please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to share the video and thanks for watching guys